Roughly six years ago, this video was taken near Taos when slowly but surely wild river otters were released into a Rio Grande tributary. Home at last after more than half a century. The last known wild or uh, native river otter in New Mexico was trapped and killed in the Gila River in the 1950s. Rachel Kahn is with Amigos Bravos, a statewide water conservation group that helped create the New Mexico Friends of River Otters Coalition in 2000. The goal was simple, get otters back into New Mexico rivers. Approached the Department of Game and Fish, their game commission, the New Mexico Game Commission, and advocated for a program to reintroduce river otters. Between 2008 and 2010, 33 otters were released, a project that cost $1,000 per animal. And since then, they've relied on people who've spotted them as far south as Lake Cochiti and as far north as Colorado. Now, they have a better way to keep a closer eye on the otters. This year, we uh, initiated a new project and that was our wildlife camera that we put out on the river in two places. The result, images of healthy otters. So even though there isn't a system to track the population growth, Khan is confident the otters are thriving and steadily reproducing. They're a beautiful species, they're at the top of the food chain, they provide critical um, important functions to the rest of the ecosystem. Madeline Schmidt, KRQE News 13.